<coughs> right, hey guys, welcome back to Kyoto Plays Oblivion. I am the master of disaster. Anyway, have you enjoyed the seats? <coughs> oh, sorry, I've got a bit of a foggy in my footy. This it better be good. It always is good with me around sunshine. Anyway, we where were we last? Um. Origin of the Grey Prince, that is it. So we've done the origin of the Grey Prince. Turns out he was a demon spawn vampire. Ah, ah, ah. And no, I'm not talking about the count from Sesame Street either. I'm talking about Count Dracula. So, like I said, I think that's all the miscellaneous quests done here in the Imperial City. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba Yep, we're back here once again where we killed the guy. Killed the guy with the arrow. And where the fight egg skilled is. You're a what? They say that. Why doesn't the elder come? Here we go. Strasa of the Mages Guild, Evoker, and. But perhaps you are in a. Straight to the... I'm searching for some specific crystals known as... Ga Wonderful. I had a... I want you to bring me as many of Garidan's tears as you can. I confess, I have a weak... This is a personal errand, you must understand. And you know what, let's do it. The tears are not just a namesake. They're literally the frozen tears of a knight named Garadan Staurus, who lived many years. I'm not certain what happened to the knight. Seek out Juliana Fanis at the Arcane University in... If anyone can... Okay. The tears are small crisp. Bring my salutation. And so that's where we're going to go now. Of the library. To go looking for those. Certainly, Garretton was a knight who lorded over a small village of peaceful farmers. One harvest summer, there was a horrible drought. The farmers appealed to Garretton to discover a solution. He spent a week consulting with sages, until one of them mentioned a possibility. Ooh. The sage told him of an artifact called the Everflow Ewer. The vessel, which looked like a silver pitcher, was said to supply endless water. Hmm. Amazing! Yes, indeed. Legend has it that Garadan found the Ewer, and that it was guarded by a fearsome creature. It is also said that the creature froze him. When Garadan realized his quest was a failure, and he wouldn't be able to return and save the farmers, he began to shed some tears. As the ice enveloped him, some of his tears were frozen as well. Some even say that the divine, Mara, took pity on the poor knight. To commemorate his kind heart, she imbued the tears with some sort of magical power. That's only rumor, though. You know, if you're really interested in more, there's a book I read once called Night. I think I saw a copy. I wish I could tell you more about them, but that. I really. It's my pleasure. Need a book? You've come to the right place. Oh, 
or not. Pleasure to serve. Fair. Alright, let's have a quick read then. back to the university it's good to see you again anything else yes i have them for sale if you'd like to buy some feel free oh, well, let's do go. business why not Thank you. Sorry, that's all I had. The refund. If you come across any unusual ingredients in. Okay, so it's there, is it so? Here it is.
two of his tears. Okay, so. Don't even show him where I am. Right, so go on from there. There should be one was right in front of me. Which I've got. Oh, there it is. Find one. F What's new? I ran across a couple of mud crabs not long ago. You look like you. You found five of the tears. Fantastic. Woohoo! Sixteen hundred gold. They're the pro. The Mage's Guild is the single best resource for out. The tears look beautiful in my collection. Okay. Leowin stands alone. Okay, so, so I've done that one as well. And may you find your way home safely each night to a warm fire. Okay, so that's actually all the skin crowd miscellaneous quests on. So that's that one done. So we are on to the next area, which is Guinea Grad. Oh, saying that though, let's go see some of these. So let's see, where can I go? This one I think would be the first one to do. And then of course I'll then move over to Skin Grad. Oh dear, excuse me, I'm a bit tired at the moment. That manor is still. If you want to buy. Excellent. Here's the key to the front door. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must attend. What's new with you? I heard people saying they ran into goblins around.
And now we've lost 5,000 gold for a death trap. Don't believe me? I'll show you. You're a sneaky looking sort. So here it is, our new home. Not that we actually need it, by the way. Okay, so we've got this. We've got the upstairs. Yeah, a little bit of what needs doing to it. Let's try it again. There we go. So we're going to increase our strength. No, actually, you know, I think our strengths. No, strengths need doing. There we go. Thank God I thought my game was going to crash then and that would have annoyed me. Let's go into the basement. I'll tell you what. As soon as you bought the place, he pretty much up and left. I hear tell he's making his way to the Imperial... Shadow hide you. And that's where we're going to go. I'm surprised to see you all. So, you think I'm responsible? <laughs> I suppose you're right. Is the man I used to be... I knew there was a curse on that place, which is why I sold it to you so cheap. My family said I could move here to the Imperial City once all our loose ends were tied down. I fear my own greed got the better of my judgment. I, I suppose I assumed you'd be able to lift the... Lorgren Benaris was a strange old man, always dabbling and experimenting with magic. He was mostly harmless, until the fateful day he came across a tome bearing the... He became a... The Dark Art. When it was discovered that he did this, the Mage's Guild called for a quick meeting to decide what to do. Led by a young upstart named Carahill, the Mage's Guild stormed Benerus Manor and slew Lorgren. However, amid the chaos, his... Because of this, the people of Anvil concluded the manor must... I'm sorry, I can't help you with the curse. You bought... According to the diary entry, it seems that I'm the only one who can open the secret door in the manor. And I can't help feeling slightly guilty selling you the place under these circumstances. I'll meet you in Anvil at the Count's Arms. From there, we'll try to lift the curse together. There we go. So that's what I needed. Here we go, guys.
Oh, come on. Accept your surrender. Lead on. I hope that whatever's behind... I'll be glad... fails to use me, how easy mortal man is to manipulate. You've assisted me in completing the very thing Carrie Hill and his cabal sought to prevent all those years ago. My ascension to immortality. Last time I clashed with mortals, I underestimated their power. I shall not repeat that mistake twice. Again! <laughs> Hmm. 
There we go. Already grabbed the rings, that's fine. Let's hand this, let's go speak to him. And that'll be it. And then I'll, we'll be done. I'm sorry for running away like that, but I'm glad you talked me into coming with you. Now that the curse is... Excellent work, my friend. May the manor give you many... Not bad. What's the news from the other parts of Tamriel? Okay, so that's it. That's all I've got time for today with this one. I hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you next time for some more... It's lame stuff. Oh, but right now, I need to sleep. So, all the stuff for me to say is don't get to love yourself, don't get, don't get to trust yourself, and more importantly, don't get to high five the sky. And I'll see you guys later.